What up, YouTube? Ed the Kid 51 here, bringing you a real, 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 real quick little update. Um, showing you uh, a couple of people were interested in this uh, Grim Reaper piece that I'm working on. Um, this is actually for somebody. Um, it's actually almost done. Got a little bit of work to do on it, but it's pretty close. Um, should actually be done this weekend. Um, the other thing I wanted to show is I got a new toy. So I kind of, I was really happy when uh, getting this toy, making this purchase. So uh, I uh, kind of wanted to show it off. Um, I also wanted to show it to certain individuals, you know, who I will not name. Um, but yeah, so here's the, uh, first off, here's the, uh, the Grim Reaper. That's the picture I'm going off of. Um, it was actually requested this particular piece. This is not my original art. This was given to me by the gentleman who uh, wanted this done. This is actually a gift. Uh, is going to be a gift for somebody. Um, and this is the picture that they wanted. So it goes my version, my rendering of it. Um, I'm gonna lighten up this a little, but keeping still some of the white. Uh, my color and my lighting is a lot different on this piece um, Sorry about my finger there uh, Just because I'm kind of keep trying to go my own route with it without It's you know without copying this hundred percent. I'm you know Got the general piece and I'm kind of going my own direction with it whatever I like and how I flow and just whatever is flowing from my brush to the uh, panel um, so I got to work on the hand a little bit more. Needs a little more, a little more color variation in there. Um, the cards, I, the cards I started a little while ago. Uh, so they need, need also needs more layering. Just con that's this whole face and the hood is just tons and tons of layering, layering of colors going back and forth between my darks, my lights, my browns, my sepias. Um, my yellow ochres, uh, just going back and forth with all the, the colors, just constantly layering back and forth. So between the hand and the cards, uh, I will be doing that. And behind this, there's some lettering. Um, so that's where that is. Uh, and here's my toy. Um, very happy with this purchase. Um, I don't know, just super happy with it, very excited. I used it for a little while yesterday. Um, it's a Iwata HP, if I can get a better grip on it. It's an Iwata HP CH. Um, I can get this to not be so blurry. You get the chest, there we go. I want a HPCH with the Mac valve. Um, came in this, you know, nice little hard plastic case. I'll just kind of open it up. I want to show you. It came with a uh, little test sheet. So, just a little spray out. Um, and it is a fairly nice, fairly nice fine line. Um, it's got a 0.3 needle um, as to where my other Iwata, uh, the HP CS, is a 3.5. Um, this is a got a bigger needle than this. Um, Semi sort of kind of the same gun. This one with the Mac valve, you can adjust the air pressure right at the tip, um, which gives you better detail and gives you that nice fine line there. Um, nowhere near as fine as this. My badge of velocity with a 0.21 needle in it which is also a very awesome gun just uh 
that one's for fine detail. Um, so that's my arsenal up there in a box. Um, I have my uh, Badger 150. That one I use for my textiles, t-shirts, hats. Because um, it just sprays better for t-shirts and hats. Better than, than these guys do. Um, but this thing, uh, I, I actually really like it. Feels great in my hand. Um, counterweight is awesome. Trigger, nice and... I, I, I got a heavy, heavy hand, heavy finger. Uh, so it's, it's got a lot of tension and I like that. Um, so, you know, it's got the, it's got the, uh, needle set there. Um, you can set it so that way you don't, you can't pull all the way back. You can only pull a certain way, a uh, certain distance back. So you get a constant spray. Uh, it just, I don't know. It just feels good. It, 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 it sprays nice detail. Um, I, I, want to say I like this one better than this one just because this is such a fine detail gun the paint you got it it's a little more finicky the the badge of velocity and I, I keep promising that I'm gonna do a, a video of um, of showing what they can do and I will I was actually just waiting to get this new one in the mail um, so now that I got it I will actually do it I'll probably do one today tonight show you guys something I just been really working on this panel I, I gotta get this done I got another job coming in um, the next couple of days so I want to get this done before that other job comes uh, but yeah this thing I really like it I really enjoy it, it does really really nice um, let me see if I can find something here that I used it on last night just kind of just testing it out uh, where did I use it last night All right, you can kind of see no, you really can't see the shadowing in between the teeth if this one would not be too blurry let's see focus focus all right you can't really see it but the shadowing in between there you go the shadowing in between the teeth that was done with that one um Again, it was just me playing around with it yesterday. Uh, where else did I kind of come up with it? Uh, I kind of think that's really all I really played with it yesterday. Um, dumped a little bit of paint in and just was playing around. Let me see, did I do anything else last night? I don't remember. It was late. <laughs> anyway. Um, so... I, I, so far, all positive for that thing. I think it, it, it just feels great, sprayed nice. You know, I kind of just played around with it here on the side of the panel. I was, um, and, uh, yeah, so I was pretty excited when I got it. Uh, the fact that I can go from a wide spray pattern to detailed all in the same gun with the same color while it's still in the cup is great instead of having to switch back and forth to another gun. Although having the three different options is also also awesome too um, so pretty much that's that so a little something on the Grim Reaper showed you my guns um, later on today tonight maybe even tomorrow morning I will do a quick video on just showing the spray patterns for all three guns alright well take it easy talk to you guys soon